Hey guys, I'm Michael Cheek with Mike'sGuitarLessons.com. Um, this is the first video for Deeper Than the Holler by Randy Travis. Now, um, this again for um, the last few songs that I've done, they're pretty much just rhythm guitar, uh, strumming and singing. There's a little bit of extra um, lead guitar in the song on this one. But for the most part, uh, most people are probably just going to want to learn this type of stuff, the rhythm guitar and strumming these chords. So um, this is going to be the first video. If you want the other videos, you can check out my website. It's www.mikesguitarlessons.com. Um, you can find me on Facebook. My group is Mike's Guitar Lessons. And on Twitter, uh, sometimes I let people know a little ahead of time what's coming. That's uh, Mike's Guitar. Okay? Now let's go ahead and get started. The chords you're going to need to start off the song um, are F. Okay, now if you want a, a more in-depth uh, tutorial over these chords, I have them on YouTube. I've also got them on my website. Just go to my chord library and you'll see a more in-depth um, tutorial over these chords. But if you can look closely, there, there's the F chord. All right. Um, you're also going to need an A sharp here. Now this is a bar chord and you can play it uh, two different ways really really three different ways probably. The way I'm going to play it is an A sharp right here as a bar chord. So first fret on the A string and then third fret on the D, G, and B string. Okay? And then you don't play the two outside strings. You could also play it up here just like the F bar chord but you bar in the sixth fret and keep everything else the same. Okay? You could play it that way. And um, to start off with, that's what you're doing, just going back and forth between the F and the A sharp. You can also play the A sharp like this. Okay, I don't love that way because when you get up here in the skinnier frets, it's hard to play it that way. But you can just use these three fingers to play third fret on the D, G, and B, and then use your first finger to play the skinny E string in the first fret. And you just play those uh, four strings. So you can do it that way as well. Um, but to start off with, again, with this song, at the beginning, basically, you're just playing back and forth between the F and the A sharp. So, and I'm trying not to play too loud. I know I'm not strumming with a pick, but you do want to use a pick here. Um, I just have a sensitive microphone, so I tend to not want to strum too loud. That's why I also have the sound hole cover here, in case you're wondering. I, I get questions about the sound hole cover every now and then. Um, so anyways, between the F and the A sharp, you're just strumming that real common uh, strumming pattern with uh, country songs, down, down, up, up, down, up, okay? Down, down, up. And basically, you just have one of those strumming patterns for each chord. So you're going to go F, just over and over again, okay? Now, that uh, is what you play for the intro, and when the, he starts singing in the verse, you start playing that too, okay? So you're actually going to play... Um, and I'll tell you where the lyrics are as well. This might help you out a little bit. I'm not going to sing it because I'm not a great singer, but uh, it starts off with, Well, I've heard those city singers singing about how they can love. And then I've got it written down here. I can't read my handwriting, though. I should have typed it. Um, Deeper than the oceans, higher than the stars above. And uh, still so you're going to do the same thing on this next line. Um, well, well, I come from the country, and I know I ain't seen it all, but I heard that, let's see, but I heard that the ocean's salty, and the stars, they sometimes fall. So you're saying you're just going back and forth between the F and the A sharp. Now we're actually going to get to another chord. It's a G minor. Really, it's just like the F chord. But you're moving your bar up to the third fret, and you're picking your middle finger up. Okay? All right. So it's barred in the third fret, and then it's uh, the only other two fingers you got to worry about are fifth fret on the A string, 
and fifth fret on the D string. Okay? And again, I've got that chord in my chord library if you want to check it out a little closer. Um, and that starts on, but that would not do justice to the way I feel for you. So, um, but that would not do justice to the way I feel for you. And on way, you're going to play an A minor chord. Okay, also in the chord library. All right, but that would not do justice to the way I feel for you. And then back to the A sharp. So I have to sing this song. Okay, so on song. So I have to sing this song about all, G minor, right when you uh, sing all, the things I know, C chord. And there's your C chord. That's the newest one for this. Uh, you only play that at the ending of this uh, verse. It's the only time you use it in the verse. So that's your C chord. Okay, so that's your C chord. All right. Now what I'll do to make things a little clearer, after you, now that you've seen all the chords, I'll actually play along with the verse and tag it on to the end of this video so that you can actually see me play along with it. So, anyways, uh, if you've got any questions, even if you're not a student of mine on the website or whatever, you can email me at feedback at mikesguitarlessons.com. And thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you stay tuned to the end of this video so you can see me actually use these chords with the song. I think it'll help out with your timing. Um, anyways, thanks for watching. Well, I've heard those city singers singing about how they can love deeper than the oceans, higher than the stars above. Well, I come from the country and